Hey, what's up, you guys? Uh, it's Buck again, and uh, so I had another question about, um, I'm hanging out in my backyard, if you don't mind. Um, I had another question about, you know, being an IMG in uh, tr getting a, a, a surgery residency by, you know, by being an IMG. So, and I'm so fucking excited that somebody cares because, you know, it was a real pain in the ass doing this going from a Caribbean medical school for me um, to to getting into a US uh, you know surgical residency and so if I can help somebody else do that in you know guide you or whatever that's freaking awesome because I didn't have shit nobody told me anything basically they just I was like on my own we just tried to figure it out so it was really tough and uh, thanks to YouTube and and technology it's hopefully it'll be a lot easier for you guys now but so the question was is specifically, I've, I've talked about like what's the best, you know, one best thing, uh, you, or you know, the, the best thing that you can do for yourself and that's getting good scores on the USMLEs. I think that's, you know, step one is, is absolutely number one in your book and if you, do, if you do nothing, you have to do well on the USMLE. If you don't, you're really going to have a tough time. You're just putting yourself at a dis disadvantage. So, the um, the qu specific question was, what what do I do for like my personal statement and on my rotations? How do I get really good uh, recommendations and stuff? And so, um, and I can't. There was something else, but I can't remember. But anyway, let me just talk about the personal statement first. So, and you know, this is. Um, I am six, seven years out of residency. Um, during residency, I interviewed a lot of applicants, like med students uh, coming into the residency. So I saw a lot of um, personal statements. I interviewed a lot of um, resident or you know med students uh, for our general surgery program. Um, I was in I was in Detroit at uh, Henry Ford Hospital. It's a big program. We took six people, uh, six I think we actually I think we took eight. But we took six, uh, I'm sorry, we graduated six, but we took eight because there was such a high attrition rate in general surgery um, uh, in general. Uh, and then, uh, you know, you're in Detroit, so a lot of people want to leave. So anyway, um, I interviewed a lot of people. I saw a lot of personal statements. This is just my take on everything. This is not, I'm not a, you know, I'm not on the board. I'm not accepting applicants anymore uh, or I don't have any input and stuff so maybe change but this is uh, for me like what I like to see is just your personality like do you have a freaking personality because here's the thing is when you're looking at these uh, students like you have to work with them right because if I'm a second year resident and I'm looking at these applicants um, even if I'm an attending I have to work with these people it's not just about like, are you going to be a good doctor? A lot of people can make it be a good doctor. Like, that's not, that's only a piece of the puzzle. And so, if you can show your personality and that you are a fun person and a good person and you, you know, are not going to, like, you know, not show up. I mean, these are, like, practical things that, you know, you have to have in a, in a resident. Like, you know, being on time and showing up and... You know, you know, shit like that. That it's just, I think, when you're going through the process, you kind of don't think about those things because you're like, oh, scores and you know, grades and do I know like, you know, potassium levels and all this other bullshit that you know is important. But you know, th these are the things that there's some more things that are important. And uh, so, show your personality. What I did is, and I don't know if it helped me or not, but. I talked about my dad and hunting and so basically I described killing an antelope at the, the very first like couple sentences and um, I know it got some attention you know it may be it was bad for some people I, I'm sure some people didn't like hunting but it did get the attention of some people and so that described my personality uh, a little bit that I was bold enough to, to do that um, but I think the other thing is that you know you the reason you want to go into medicine like you know and you got to do it like from the heart you know I mean that's the other thing that people are looking for like what the hell do you want to just make a bunch of money which you know, doesn't always happen anymore in medicine but 
Are you doing that or what is your reason and what is your why? Because the important thing about the why is, is that I kind of talked about this before, but if you have a really strong why, then you're going to, you know, you're going to stick it out. Like when there's a cardiothoracic surgeon yelling at you, screaming, you're a fucking idiot from across the table in front of the entire OR, this happened to me, like you don't just go home and quit, right? So you have to have that why in the back of your head, like what are you doing, why are you still here, who are you, you know, trying to help and what are you doing this for and why do you want to come back and why do you even want to stay in that fucking operating room with this asshole, right? Because, and then tomorrow you got to see him again, so are you going to show up? Like these are the, these are kind of things that are important. So, um, I, I rambled, but, but uh, basically that's, you know, these are the kind of things that people are looking for in the personal statement. Uh, which is maybe not what traditionally you would think that you know you're looking for but th that's per for me that's what I was looking for um, the set the second question was is uh, do you actually maybe I'll make another video for that yeah okay fuck it that's that's the end of this one and uh, subscribe to my channel and shit and uh, I'll talk to you guys later I'll make I'll make another video on the rotations and how to uh, get, you know, good uh, references from your rotations. All right, peace.